Egypt, for example, really played well for themselves. They competed in the end. Uh, you know, Lithuania was just a little too strong. Then Mexico also fall against Lithuania. So for Montenegro, if they win this game and Lithuania beat Mexico, they will be assured of moving on to the second round. So Egypt win the opening tip here as uh, their game gets underway against Montenegro. Against Mexico. He's got the basketball right now. That was in the third quarter, particularly when he came to life. Here's the pass, and Radoncic comes in from the right corner in his opening game. And since here is the pass to Marai, goes in, swatted. Radoncic again, and he goes hard to the basket and scores. They have a mean left open and knocks down the three. Egypt go back in front. Well, we can see him. We can see that already from him today. Asimarais, look at the hustle from him, saving an inbounds. And Shusha drives in and another layup. What an inspired decision by Roy Rana to get him in the lineup. Perry hands it off and for the third time in the game, Radoncic goes up. A chance for Montenegro to go back in front here. Simonovic makes the three. Again, the front court three point shooting. There goes Abu Shusha. This time loses it. Good hands from Radoncic and then Perry, like a bullet out of a gun, goes up and look at Simonovic. Go up for the putback dunk. Perry. Again to Vucevic, and he turns and scores. Jump hook with the left. Habamin gets the steal. And they miss with the second chance. Perry explodes to the basket, and another putback, this time by Rodoncic. I said Marai backing up, and Vucevic reaches around, knocks it away. Look at the behind the back pass, and the layup, Rodoncic. So Ruriana. Here goes Gardner. And nice offensive rebound put by this time by Anas Mahmoud. So Samurai getting a breather here. And alley -oop to Vucevic. Beautiful high low. Into the post here for Montenegro, post reaction. Boy, that's a thankless task guarding Vucevic. Yeah, just the great patience. Soft release from Anas Mahmoud. Figure out a way to keep Montenegro out of the lane. And boy, he is almost impossible to stop, really. He's waiting for some post reaction. If there's nothing there, then he goes into his one on one mode. Good pass. Gardner, one last chance, and finally he knocks it down. Musa goes out as well. So we have Zarhan. Get it to Gindu. The captains have come in. He hits a three pointer. How about that? How quickly things can change when a couple of shots fall. Play at your speed under control. Mihailovic puts it up and in. Oh, great defense, Musa getting the hands up. Slavkovic then gets blocked. Great work, Anas Mahmoud, and just relentless Montenegro still get the basket. Karim El Ghazawi is in the game, number one as well, under 19 basketball World Cup player. And Anas Mahmoud gets another block. Here he is, the youngster. And Ahab Amin takes what the defense gives him. Great decision making there. I don't know what the situation is, but clearly something not right. Ivanovic takes it away from Ahab Amin. And another costly turnover. That's pretty impressive. Um, 14 points off turnovers have been scored by Montenegro. That's the recipe for disaster for Egypt. There's Ahab Amin, and they need him to be. Here's Dublovic. Short, Amin again, off to the races. Pulls up from deep and knocks it down. And really, when he gets it going, he is a... Took a quick shot. They can get a better shot than that. 
And again, the result is a three at the other end. Ivanovic for three. And that is soul destroying for months for Egypt. Here's Ahab Amin again. Excellent work, Shusha, with the rebound. He goes up. There's contact, no call. And Gardner with the offensive rebound and put back. And look at Roy Rana. He's like, where's the call? Bosco's got to be upset with the multiple efforts, second effort on the boards at the other end. Ivanovic again. It's good, boy. It's just. Ivanovic responding right when they needed him. Oh, now, turnover. And this has been toxic for Egypt. And going in, Radovic. So we saw Asamurai back on the bench. Hopefully he'll be coming back into the game. Here's Gardner for three. He's a, he's a talent. Yeah, outstanding. Rick Schmitz. Slavkovic works his way down, banks it in. In the back, just to see if he can get back to normal. Sarhan. Looked like Sarhan was going to take it, but uh, Ahab Amin hustled down. Unless the allergy is taken. Look at Ahab Amin. I mean, you can't sleep on him either. Look at this. Look at the speed. Look at him get down there. Ahab Amin. Danilovic is the uh, president of the Federation. Here's Perry goes down for the dunk. And they blow the whistle as well. As Egypt retreats into a 2-3 zone from the free throw. So they cut it back to 10. Popovich, though, with a little floater coming from, from Egypt. Musa in the game, the 2-3 zone. Popovich the second time in a row, and then it leads to two more points for Montenegro, and all of a sudden they got a 14-point lead. That Gardner has gone up against to have that type of potential to stop that shot like Vucevic. No, if you oh, look, look at this. Terrific steal from Adam Musa, and he's taking it right to a Kendrick Perry. Great start right there from Musa. Entry pass, Vucevic turns and scores. I mean, that's beautiful teamwork, Vucevic. Perry, it's the layup, great drive. Vucevic out to Perry, behind the arc. The three-pointer is good. Outstanding teamwork. And the drive, what a play for Anas Mahmoud. Vucevic going up against Anas. Wow. The definition of go-to low post score. Shusha, quickly, great block, Simonovic. Doncic, the double team comes and they force the turnover. And a bounce pass to Shane. It's nice for Egypt. Ooh, boy. Terry goes down, a little bit of pain. Vucevic just hits another bucket. How about that? I did not see that spin move coming. How about that? They have a mean. Another bucket for him. A three. Zubovic spins, turns. Anas quickly up the floor. Gets rid of it to Hussein. And he, I'll tell you, a player that can finish at the rim is Omar Hussein. Gazawi elects not to put it up. Nice Away slip. Better shot. And they're going to get it. And he is fouled. Anas Mahmoud. Cuts it to 14 and is going to the line. He runs into the screen, slips to the rim, and then look at the active length and finish through the contact. Gindy trying to keep him out. He turns, he gets blocked. But Anas couldn't pick up the basketball, and that's a that's a killer. Where's the shirt? Here's uh, the turnover. Radovic. Quick pass over to Ivanovic, the guy that you like, and that's why you like him. But this was a great play. And Gendy. Good effort, Anas. Gets it back. Nice pass to Gindy. 
gets the three right back. Gardner trying to defend against Dublovich. That's a strong move from Dublovich. Anas. Oh, Anas just took a shot to the face from Dublovich. He's looking at the ref. Again, he's, he's quite right, man. He took a slap. The physicality and controlling the tempo by playing through the post. Most teams want to play pick and roll. They want to do other things, shoot threes. I Look really at they have, I mean. Burying it from downtown. Mihailovic. There's uh, the dump down low and Radovich scores. Well, maybe we won't see the starters. I don't know if you notice it, but I'm curious. Here goes uh, Ahab. Oh, there's slam, bam, thank you, ma'am. Mihailovic missing. There's Gordon with the rebound. Oh, and ends up being a bounce pass to Mihailovic for the layup. He set him up perfect. So the lead goes back to 16. Another bucket for Ahab Amin. He's got 26. Perry and Vucevic back into the game here to finish it the last three minutes. And another bucket. Gindi with the lob and the throw down again from Anas Makmu. World Cup lives right now. They have a mean, hands it off, and the dunk. And one coming for Khaled. He wants them to execute and get a good shot. He wants them to play with defensive discipline and finish possessions. Mihailovic takes the shot and hits it. He's kind of become, you gotta put it up. They do, and tough shooting day for Gindi. He finishes just two of eight from three-point range.